Hey nerds, Steven here with a wee bit of a rant about DCU Online. As you know, it's gone free to play. And I recently, if you saw last week's pick, got it. And I started up, of course it takes a long update, all that kind of stuff, expected. But then it had the crazy awesome character creation. I was so excited. I mean, I was creating the fact that I'm like, I'm a fat, I've got speed, I've got fire powers, and I've got martial arts, which is so awesome. And of course, I originally was like, I'm gonna have a cape. But then I'm like, if I've got speed, and martial arts, you can't do a cape. So you've got to match the whole outfit. Having your mask match your boots, everything like that. It was awesome, I spent like 30 minutes on it. And then what happens when you get in the game? They give you gear and you're like, oh man, I need that 13 plus defense, that is a necessity. And it gave me a cape! I just decided not to have a cape and then they changed my mask. Do you realize that I just spent so long making it to my match? My mask actually matched my boots, my belt, my entire outfit. If you've got flash-like abilities, if you've got martial arts abilities, you need to have your gear match your abilities. What is this, 1933 where everybody's wearing a freaking suit? No, this is freaking DCU. I've got to look good. I've got to be ready to run and I don't need a cape. I don't want my mask to change. Seriously, this is ridiculous. If I wanted that, I would have done that in the character creation, not afterwards with my gear. What was the point of having such an immense character creation?